What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. Uh, I just got done dropping Scooby off from school. I just wanted to talk to y'all guys. Just wanted to tell you guys that I feel great after that walk. You know, because you usually feel the pain the next day in, in your legs. Maybe sometimes for me it'd be like two days, like tomorrow. Maybe I feel it. So, so, so far, so good. I will keep y'all updated on how I feel because, you know, I haven't done a whole lot of anything. I mean, you can tell. Can y'all tell like I ain't wait? Y'all can tell, right? <laughs> Face all fat and stuff. But I'm enjoying myself. I'm enjoying my fatness and stuff. And cause girl, I had got me some boob chat. Hey. <laughs> y'all know I was on the itty bitty titty committee, but um girl, she graduating now. She graduating. I ain't mad either. I like them. But anyway, child, um, I had stopped to get me an orange juice from Burger King. I stopped to get me an orange juice this morning. I already had me some water. Um, this morning, so I'm opening me an orange juice up, and I, um, what you looking at? I won't be done got beat up. I can't be talking junk. They look me right in my face, and I guess they figured I was talking to them, but <laughs> how I'm going to be talking to you and you way over there? Anyway, I think today I need to wash a whole bunch of clothes. Last night, I washed them clothes, and I left them in the dryer. No, I left them in the washing machine. And I woke up this morning, and they was funky. Now, I know I got to rewash them and everything. But sometimes, if I rewash clothes like that, because they was like Scooby clothes, and some of my clothes mixed together. So, if I, if I, um wash those clothes like that, how do I get that smell out of there, y'all? I know I'm going to go get me some Gain laundry detergent. Um, hopefully that'll work. I was reading on the internet that said vinegar and all of this stuff, but I don't want my clothes to smell like vinegar either. But um, I haven't washed them before and it came out, but I'm just trying to make sure because it seemed like, it seemed like to me this time it's like a little extra funky. So um, I don't know. Ooh, this orange juice so good. Ugh. Yeah, it seemed like a little extra funky, so I don't know. Help us with that, y'all. Y'all already know I be needing help. I be asking y'all. All kind of stuff. Y'all be helping me too, child. Fucking hills ratchet. One not polished. One got chipped. These three, whatever, child. I was just doing the most. I was experimenting, trying some new nail polish too. But yeah, y'all, I got those Huggies diapers. I don't like no damn Huggies. You hear me? I do not like no Huggies because I had the same issue when my babies was babies. When my grown behind children was babies, the reason why I didn't like Huggies is because when they pee pee, this gel stuff come out like little beads of foam or silicone or whatever it is. And I didn't, you know, that was when my kids was little. This stuff came out. So I didn't think nothing of it. I'm like, okay, everybody recommended Huggies. So I went and got Huggies. I'm like, man, I hope this ain't, I hope they done changed by now. Same thing. Don't you know my baby, my oldest baby is 23 years old and Huggies has not changed that f formula or whatever, how that stuff seeps out of those diapers ever? <clears throat> I don't like that. And she had all these little beady balls, little tiny dots of I don't know what on her butt when I changed her diaper. Hate that, hate that. I finished that pack. Okay, so I went ahead and... The next pack of diapers she used, I used Pampers. So the Pampers worked out great. She gonna end up wearing, getting Pampers from now on because they work great for her in her um, her level of wetness, you know. So soon she gonna be in uh on on the potty anyway, and you know hopefully she does good. I'm gonna try to start her out, you know, as soon as I can get a pot. I'm just not trying to spend like an arm and a leg on a pot. I ain't bought a baby pot in a long time. So we probably gonna get a pot from a yard sale or something. Baby done already used, clean it up, and she gonna use that if I can find one. But they don't be having no yard sales down here like that. But child, I think I'm finna get ready to go into the Dollar Tree and see if they got this um OxyClean stuff. And I'm gonna try and see if that'll help me with my laundry today. And um I need some more. I need I need to pick up a couple of things. I might need to take y'all in the store with me. I don't know. Yeah, I'll probably do another video and upload that tomorrow. Y'all come to the Dollar Tree and, and 
no, I ain't going to Walmart. Probably Family Dollar or General Dollar to get me some um laundry detergent because I need to wash. I don't know if I'm going to wash the deal tomorrow, though. I don't know. But I had, to, I had to come on here and talk to y'all real quick and let y'all know. I feel good. My leg's not sore, but I know it's probably going to kick in tomorrow, maybe. I'll, I'll keep y'all updated on how... You know how my legs feel. I was kind of nervous about riding that bicycle in my groin area because I always I already be having pain like down in my hip area. But riding that bicycle, I didn't feel I didn't feel like no kind of hurt, no kind of nothing on there. But I do need to get me a camera thing to hold my camera with, and I need to fix my brakes on my bicycle like let my husband fix my brakes when he get home because they don't act like they want to work like on one of them handlebars y'all know i got it from a yard sale right so one of those uh my left brake maybe i don't got enough strength to squeeze it but yeah i do because i was squeezing it hard and it still wasn't like it wouldn't let me stop i'm like wait a minute now we can't be having no accidents because i'm old now y'all know when old people fall they have to go to the hospital and all kind of stuff but um now a sister ain't finna be falling now because uh i ain't got time i've been through enough <laughs> but i don't think i'm gonna fall anyway because i got my balance like real good thank god i'm coordinated a little bit you feel me because i would probably bust my tail yesterday but um i did have a lot of fun on it and i had more fun on the bicycle talking to y'all than just riding the bicycle by myself you know by itself without talking to y'all because it, it seemed like it made it interesting because i was actually talking to y'all with the phone and riding the bicycle at the same time. I don't know. Is this a coordination thing? I don't know. Maybe if I wouldn't, I didn't have nobody to talk to. It wouldn't have been as fun, but I had a great time on my bicycle and hopefully I can get on my bicycle again, you know, soon. But my husband, we don't, um, my husband only rides when I ride. So if my husband is not with me when I'm on my bicycle, I won't be on my bicycle. I'll be walking because my husband actually, picked the bicycle up and put it in the truck and then we went to the track we didn't ride the bike to the track we he picked it up and put it in there so i can't do all of that so he gonna have to go with me when i ride my bike unless i'm riding it through the neighborhood and i don't want to do that because i'm not gonna be getting chased by crew joe and, and all of them dogs benji and bam and all of them now you're not gonna bite me my ankles i need my ankles boom hey my camera falling yeah, I need my ankles, boo. I can't, I can't be getting bit by dogs riding through the neighborhood. So, um, I will. Um, girl, my phone decided it wanted to fall out the window, so I had to get out to pick it up. That's why I was like pausing for a second. I was like, "What the heck was that?" Anyways, um, yeah, I was just coming to chat with y'all to let y'all know, give y'all an update on me and how I was feeling. Thank God, um, you know, y'all, that struggle be real when it's time to go to the doctor. I be kind of emotional and all of that because it is nerve-wracking but i don't want to talk about that right now child so i don't know what my microphone is in here <laughs> yes but yeah that'd be nerve-wracking to me but i'm good now i oh yeah and i don't have to go back to the doctor until um september i know i told y'all i had two doctor's appointments but the doctor had me reschedule my Thursday appointment until September. So I think it's like September 27th, 24th, September some child. So I had to go back again and get rechecked again. So that's my next doctor's appointment. So y'all know I'm going to be with y'all for that too. So uh, let me end this video right here because my camera is about to cut off. And um, I think I covered everything for right now, y'all. Thank y'all for watching. That's all I got to say in this video. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.